How to make the lagging speed ramp effect. Today's video is sponsored by the scammers. Find the part of your clip that you want to start the effect. Cut it in that point, select the second part, right click on it and select the retime controls. This is the easiest way to change the speed of your clip. Just grab the top right part of the clip and drag it in to make your clip faster. Once you are satisfied with the speed ramp, go 12 frames before the cut, make another cut, right click on this one and make it a new fusion clip. Open it in the fusion page and add a time stretcher node. Double click to the source time to reset it, right click on it, and select to modify it with shake. Go to the modifiers tab, bring down the smoothness slider all the way, set the maximum slider to 11, and go back to the edit page. You can keep it as it is if you want, or you can cut 12 frames from the beginning of your second clip, and repeat the same process again, so that you have the lagging effect before and after the transition. Once you are done with this, bring an adjustment clip on top of those three cuts. Go to the open FX and bring a camera shake to the adjustment clip. Play around with the shake sliders to find out what works best for you. Go into the beginning of the adjustment clip, activate the keyframe button for the motion scale slider and bring it down to zero. Go in the middle and bring it up to two. Go into the end of the adjustment clip and bring it down to zero again. If you like this clip, subscribe to this channel. If you didn't, you've just wasted your time.